I, I really found that when studying at Monash, I kind of fell in love with econometrics. It wasn't something that I initially thought that I'd like. Um, but what I found really exciting and interesting about econometrics was that I could deal with real world problems in a more sort of coherent and professional way. So we could apply some, some of the maths we've learned, go over some real world data and actually look at what are the real effects of a policy change or a shock to the economy or you know, how can we fix our health system and we can actually get some really coherent policy outcomes and that was something that I thought was really interesting and exciting rather than learning dry theories. Let's, let's actually come up with an answer, does this policy work or does it not work? Well, one of the big attractions of studying an honours degree at Monash is the collegiate atmosphere uh, with a lot of the staff. My, my honours thesis couldn't have happened without the support of not only my supervisor, but a lot of the members of staff. Um, and as an honours student, you're not really a student, it's not like undergraduate. Uh, they treat you like you're a member of the faculty, so you know, we've, got, we've gone out um, to grab coffee with many members of staff and just chatted about what's going on in uh, the world and in particular with the world of econometric research quite a couple of times throughout the year and that's fantastic, it's something you don't get within an undergraduate degree. Well, so, so one of the really interesting things about econometrics at Monash is uh, the incredible breadth of things you can do as part of your thesis, your, your main project throughout your year of study. Um, so for example, mine was on macroeconomics, so I was looking at the different effects of fiscal policy throughout the business cycle. Uh, other people did more financial topics because uh, they wanted uh, financial stock careers. Other people looked at health, uh, the relationship between prescription drug use and mental health or development in East Timor. So there was an incredible breadth of different studies. So one of the attractions of econometrics is you're, you're learning the tools to answer policy questions, but those policy questions aren't just, let's look at the economy. It's a lot broader than that. And that was one of the big attractions of studying econometrics. Monash is uh, one of the best econometrics universities in the world. So I think we're ranked in the top 10. Uh, and the environment of studying at Monash for econometrics is, is just sort of fantastic. And so I, I, I did my undergraduate uh, at Monash and that's where I really fell in love with econometrics. And so I knew that this was really the faculty for me because you had such a sort of supportive network. We're, we're one of the very few universities in the world that has a dedicated econometrics faculty rather than sort of being tacked on as part of an economics or a mathematics department. And so having our own dedicated faculty meant that we could really focus in the stuff that I was interested in, which was great. Um, econ econometrics is really enjoyable if that's something if uh, you're interested in maths or you're interested in policy. Um, so, but beyond that, it's also very employable, which a, a lot of graduates these days are very much thinking about. Well, can I get a job with what I study? Uh, and basically, all of us who have studied honors this year have walked into great jobs. Um, I'm working at the Department of Foreign Affairs and Trade. We have some at consulting firms like Deloitte. We have. Um, other people in other areas of public service or other consulting firms or finance uh, and so not only is it something that's quite interesting to study but you get a good grad job out of it which is uh, pretty convenient in this job market. Well one of the big attractions of studying at Monash is it's in Melbourne which has been rated year after year by, by The Economist as the world's most livable city um, and uh, this is something I know all too well because I grew up elsewhere in Australia I'm originally from Adelaide uh, and Melbourne is just a fantastic place to live. Uh, we have amazing cafes, great, great culture. Uh, we, we, ha we have beaches, we have parks. Um, it's a very, very green, green city, and there's a whole lot of stuff to do as, as a student uh, <laughs> after dark. Great, great night scene, which, which I think is just fantastic and really, really makes, you, makes your student life a lot more fun.